Hello, my beautiful Scorpios. Welcome to my channel. This is your favorite fortune teller, Divine Light. And today I'm going to do a coffee cup reading for your overall energies. At the end of your reading, I'm going to pull some cards to get more clarity to a question in your mind. Also, I'm going to leave a link up here if you would like a private reading from me. You can just go ahead and book your reading from there. By the way, only 30% of you haven't subscribed. If you're enjoying these videos, don't forget to hit subscribe and become a member of this beautiful soul community. Subscription is free. You can unsubscribe anytime you want, but it helps the channel a lot and also helps to get this message to the ones who really need to hear it as well. Let's jump into your reading. Let's see what is coming your way. I see here, actually, there's a full moon on the back of the cup and in the middle of the cup as well i see somebody's bringing you a gift like carrying a bag this looks like money this can be someone that you know there's a path opening for you unexpectedly and it has also another uh, like a gift or something this is coming unexpectedly this can be someone you don't even know maybe someone that you're going to be meeting maybe somebody who's traveling from another country like a family member or a cousin or someone that you're going to meet and they're going to come with gifts they're going to come bearing gifts we have an evil eye in the bottom of your cup the evil eye can be a negative energy surrounding you this doesn't have to be specifically somebody else's evil eye this can be also like maybe if you're having like this negative mind patterns mind chatter happening constantly that can be draining your energy that's why it is present here okay what we do I don't usually do this, but I am felt and called to do it. And I want to open it up and see what's inside. Okay. What's happening in there? You can see there are two people, a male figure and a female figure. I interpret this as a female figure, but there's a third person as well. Just shaking their finger. As you can see, they're shaking their finger right there. This evil eye might cause by mm, three people arguing okay or maybe two people a couple is arguing and there's a third person just pouring gas onto the situation okay so um if you're in that kind of a situation the best way to see i see the two um that are arguing the couple arguing has couple can be also friends partners they don't have negative intentions i feel like they just have a lot of tension the tension is not really on them because of them it's because of the circumstances they're in they have a very light white aura however that person that is shaking the finger has a black aura meaning this person has negative intentions so if somebody is trying to break up your partnership friendship relationship um be aware of that because that person might actually have negative energy maybe they have the evil eye they're sending you the evil eye okay they're giving you the evil eye so be aware of that and do not go along with other people's like their uh, if they're giving you like negative support in a situation instead of giving you perspective for example if you're having an argument with a partner that you have with a good friend that you have and you're sharing with a third person and that person is giving you negative feedback or telling you oh yeah that person is really bad just don't be friends with them anymore uh, do not go along with their information with their feedback just ask yourself the question like was it what is this person gaining from that and uh, why is this argument happening right now and how can i resolve this okay i see here there's a legal paper showing up that's going to be like um after you travel a path there is a contract showing this can be like a new job opportunity because i see you're entering into an environment that has very active people this can be like sportsmanship type of a thing or can also be like an environment that people are actively working on projects and doing things very dynamic environment i see here a ring and there's actually a person sitting on there the ring can be the commitment that you're going to be getting. You might have like a trial period when you step into that environment. And after that certain trial period, you get along, you get used to the environment. You're actually going to get an offer. And this seems like the offer is actually you're signing a contract right here. There is there are many paths opening in front of you after you sign the contract. This can be like a sales job or something that is actually allow you to travel um, while you are, um, you know, doing this job i see like three four five six seven eight different paths are opening in front of you one of them has like this little furnitures or maybe like material things that you're going to be grabbing this can be a job that you're going to be traveling making contracts with people i see a lot of mushrooms growing under it mushrooms actually indicate um 
fast growing wealth. Uh, so you are probably gaining, making money for yourself and for others as well at the same time. I also see now I'm looking at this perspective, somebody's smiling here. So when you change your attitude towards the things with this person, the relationship, the attitude, um, you're going to be smiling at the end. You're going to be the one smiling. Okay, let's get into your plate now. If you have a question, a desire, an intention, hold it in your mind. Let's see what the answer is going to be. There's actually a house on the hill. There is a halo around it i see a woman here she has like she's holding up children here she's taking care of people this can be like um spiritual energy you can see there's a male figure also behind he's trying to enter into this environment i don't think he's going to be able to whatever that you're desiring coming really soon i see two people communicating here unless you allow him He's not going to be able to enter in because you have a protection bubble surrounding you and this can be in your heart Maybe you are actually creating this beautiful family environment or maybe close intimate environment. This can be in the workspace that you're going to be stepping in or maybe simultaneously while you're creating this beautiful workspace, we are stepping in there. Um, the income coming through, the energy that you're going to be gaining out of that space is actually going to uh, reflect on your home life as well, okay? in your living quarters i see here that uh, protection bubble also seems like um, a big fish here appearing also but it's it's the horizon i feel like that's the horizon and i see a cow right there cow can also be a taurus but if taurus female so this can indicate that maybe there is like a feminine energy uh, of someone also fertility it indicates fertility as well if you're pre like asking and waiting for um a new baby can be a sign of that as well it's coming through though it's still in the air so it is a wish that you actually set an intention you set out there to the creator to the ascendant masters and they're going to be actually bringing this to you it doesn't have to be especially baby this can be like a new thing that you want to start as well okay and joy is fun i want to see something creative it can also be something creative for you okay Egg. <laughs> cannot make this up a creative endeavor <laughs> okay let's see what the messages are for these cards we have the ascended master it comes with the spirit okay let's see what the ascended masters wants you to know right now okay mm -hmm. jesus buddha hilarion and saint german okay they have the symbols actually symbolizes those the spirit world is filled with dynamic entities who long to assist you in all areas of your life some of these are the ascended masters those who have lived on the earth plane before and now work from energetic realm this card is telling you to look at your life and open up to the master that those Mm, most resonates with the solution you're seeking at this at this time this card is bringing you the presence of high masters of enlightenment including jesus buddha and others of profound spiritual influence in the world okay as the masters of love um they can open your heart to experiencing the unconditional love you deserve to have your for yourself and they can bring a more loving attitude to your life and your world as well as well as greater compassion to and for the other people around you okay these actually you're gonna seven seven eight okay seven is knowledge strategy eight is actually richness consistency and karma so you are actually divinely guided this can be a dream state that you're gonna actually receive a message maybe or uh in an environment that you are a spiritual environment when you're in maybe you're meditating when you're doing like some sort of like a somatic exercise uh the message will come through and that's believe that's going to be a divine message and joy's fun actually indicates that you may be engaging in um entertaining pursuits that bring a sense of happiness into your life when you choose to have some fun your bliss will expand this indicates that you're going to be like it or not you're gonna find yourself in an environment that people are having fun and you're gonna be having fun in that environment as well while you're having fun you might receive a creative impulse or maybe like uh you might call to uh make a painting play an instrument or 
even like whatever is your creative endeavor that you're going to be calling called to do that thing okay and this actually indicates um a great time of uh, creativity for you okay so follow that creative action set aside your doubts share your talents with the world and express your soul's desire this card is singing your pra uh, praises and so should you this basically indicates that if you have like a, a creative endeavor all of us have it doesn't have to be a known exercise it doesn't have to be like painting and um all like the um, doing things with our hands or with our voice it doesn't have to be it can be anything that you are creating okay so uh call follow that inspiration because it is going to lead you to the abundance that you're seeking okay right my beautifuls that's all for today hope you enjoy your reading if you do don't forget to give us some a thumbs up and if you want to see more of these go ahead and subscribe to my channel i wish you all a magical day bye